your company has given you that talks about features and benefits and talks about the product itself. But what happens is, is a really good sales professional will think, but how does this really relate to my client and how does this really relate to the problems that I know they have? The sales professionals that can adapt the information that the company has given them and really hone it in to what is that person who I'm speaking to, what is their role, who are the people who are going to attend this meeting, what is their relationship, what is their, are they the decision maker or not, are they, in, are they the influencer, and really customize that information to that person. So for example, if you're presenting to the CFO, you're going to have to have a lot of numbers early on, or he or she is going to be raising their hands and saying, but how much is it going to cost, and show us a case study, and things of that nature. So you, you want to rearrange your information. So having said that, let's talk about how to put your information together. I'm going to introduce you to our Craft Compelling Content format. You do not to write this down because at the end of this session, we are going to give the Craft Compelling Content format to you free of charge. It will be a, a, a document that you, we, 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 will, we are happy to send you in a PDF form if you'd like it. Okay? So my, my suggestion right now is just to listen to the format and then you're going to get the whole thing after. Okay. So, Obviously, every presentation has an introduction. Ours has four elements, and you and I are going to spend all our time on this web session just talking about the introduction. Then, of course, there's the body of the talk where you're really getting into, here's what we have to offer, Mr. Customer. And then the conclusion is the wrap-up, the value statements, and then, of course, next steps. Today, I'm going to spend a lot of my time on 